How are you guys doing? In today's video from HowStuffingMyCarWars.com I'm going to show you how to replace the ignition tumbler on a 1995 Ford F-150. Take into consideration that these steps will be similar to all Ford pickup trucks that have this body style. The process is super simple and easy to do, so it's only going to take you a couple minutes. And you'll be able to get rid of this common problem among this pickup truck which is eventually the key gets harder and harder to turn or you have to waggle it or some crazy stuff the first thing to do is disconnect your negative battery cable for safety last thing you want to do is deploy your airbag when you're doing this repair and injure yourself once you're done disconnecting the negative battery cable if your truck has a tilt wheel like this one go ahead and remove the tilt wheel lever right here unscrew it and set it aside. Next, there are three Phillips screws that fasten the lower steering column cover. Use a Phillips screwdriver and remove all three of them. Once you're done removing the screws, remove the lower steering column cover and set it aside. Next step, insert the key on the ignition switch and turn it to the on position. Right beneath the cavity where the tumbler slides in, there's a pin right there that you need to press in. Once it's pressed in all the way, and remember the key needs to be on the on position, otherwise you won't be able to press it in slide the key and tumbler out just like that in this particular case the gear came off with the tumbler now this doesn't happen all the time sometimes this stays on make sure you install it the same way on the new tumbler otherwise your ignition will be off when you turn the key on it won't be on I mean, it'll, or it won't lock so this has to go in the same position on the new tumbler as it is on the old one Apply a light coat of grease to the gears to ensure it's smooth operation. Either lithium grease or high temp grease, you know, something that's not going to melt. Um, this will ensure that, the, that your lock and key and tumbler will work smoothly. Turn your new tumbler to the on position and install it in the cavity. You'll know which way it's on because you'll be able to depress the pin so you can slide it in. There you go, you can feel it snap. You should be able to see the pin when you return it to the off position. You should see the pin locking on the cavity, not allowing the locking key and tumbler to slide out see it's on it's tight and ensure it's operation there is trying to start on off accessory and then I have my battery disconnected so I, that's what you cannot hear it right now but that's how simple it is you know there you go it's working perfect take my key off brand new key so this key won't match your door anymore because it's completely different Finish by installing your lower steering column cover 
followed by the tilt lever. Connect your negative battery cable back on and you're done. And that's how simple it is to replace a worn out ignition tumbler on a 1995 F series pickup. Make sure you subscribe to our channel. We upload new videos every week. Also, don't forget to visit our online store. We have a wide selection of accessories for cars, trucks, and SUVs. See you next time.